concerns this is Marishi in my channel Chiloka. Let's see what is your situation as of now and what do you need to hear from me for this coming week. Concerns out there. So I'm not You need to know. Just one more time. Concerns. Your first card is a six of swords in reverse. Okay? So uh, you might have uh, been in a situation where there was so much conflict, okay? There was so much going on um, verbally as well, okay? So much conflicting. You were in a conflicting situation and now things might have come to a complete full stop, okay? There is no moving ahead with the situation. So you're deciding or um, you made up your mind that this is not going anywhere. It's it's a sunken um, titanic for me. Okay, so your first card uh, shows me um, a situation which has come to a complete full stop. Okay, some of you might be dealing with an Aquarius. What else, please? Knight of Cups. That explains. Uh, so this might be something to do with a person, okay, for whom uh, or this person doesn't want to offer you anything. That is why it has come to a complete full stop or you don't want to accept anything from this person, okay. Some of you might be dealing with an Aquarius or a Pisces person. Strong Aquarius in your reading or maybe a lead. Okay, so it, it has taken you so much courage to actually end something with this person. Hmm? You weren't interested in this person anymore, in whatever they had to offer. What else please? Concern. Actually, okay, this is your card. Charity in reverse. And I'm looking at the magician. So it's almost like uh, you're wielding your want, you have the power to go about your life however you want it to be, okay? So you are actually using that, you know, actually executing that power to decide how you want to go on with your life, okay? Because whatever that situation, again, two cards, which is like, um, you, you're letting go of the reins, okay? You chant it in reverse, okay? But in reverse. So you, you don't have the power to fix the situation anymore. It has already come to a dead end. This whole thing has drowned already and you cannot save it anymore. So you're letting go of the reins, okay? Yes. For some time, you might have juggled with this whole situation, okay? You might have juggled to make it work. And then you realize it's not going anywhere. You have to let go. Hmm? You cannot bring it back on track, so you need to let go. What else? Concerns out there. Judgment. So you're coming through as a queen of roads, okay? Very determined to make things go your way, how you want it. Very determined, with a strong willpower, okay? Some of you might be dealing with a Pisces or an Aries person. So you're making a verdict, okay? You're making, passing a judgment with regards to a situation. You might have juggled for, uh, uh, with this situation for quite some time to make it work, but now you're coming to that uh, conclusion that this is not going anywhere I don't have a control over the situation anymore it has completely come to a dead end so the judgment has been passed okay concerns what else for wants this might be a person whom you had a relationship with who you might have been living with. You 
might have been married with this person okay but yes with the ten of pentacles as well you had some kind of a stability with this person once upon a time because that is not on offer anymore okay this is regards to your home life yes three of wands so now i see you very adamant okay there is a strong will to look past this making um making a judgment regards to how things are okay and then looking past it hmm? you're almost there with a vision that you need to have this stability in your life because this is the center of the reading the four of wands some of you are working towards making uh the stability come in your life okay so you letting go of something and you working towards something which is nice some of you might be dealing with a very strong aries energy this has literally collapsed whatever the foundation you had previously it has already collapsed it has come down the foundation is broken okay that is why you are looking past it okay um yeah you want an opportunity to have this again in your life now you're looking forward to having a four of wands in your life letting go of something and hoping for something new to come to having a stability in your life again that's that's what you're waiting on which is nice what else please five swords Now this is the third time we have got an Aquarius uh, card in your reading. Some of you might be dealing with a Capricorn. You were juggling with this whole situation with this person for some time, trying to see how things will go. Okay, but yet it didn't work out. They didn't want to offer you anything, or you didn't want to accept whatever they were willing to offer. Hmm. you were putting up a fight you were fighting a battle which wasn't even worth it because the other person wasn't interested they have already walked away they were not on the same page as you okay you did wait a wait for this person to come back yeah to to your pentacles you did it did try to put a balance you know try to juggle things bring a balance within the situation what else please this one yes so now after all what has happened okay a tower might have happened yeah um things might have blown out but this has happened in the past this is a past energy So now you're already there where you decide I need to transition from this whole crap I was living with whole crap I was trying to make it work you know it's it's not worth it anymore so you're deciding to stop fighting and literally move on from the past leave the dead behind not even bothered with the person anymore So you come to that stage where you decide I need to focus on my future now. I need to, you know, look past everything from the past and try to see where I can put in my energy, 
where I can start manifesting something which is more stable, which will be, uh, bring in security in my life. So you focus on that. Hmm? There is a very strong determination in the way. Even um, I saw the Queen of Rots previously. So there is a strong determination about, you know, having a better future. Some of you might be dealing with a scorpion. Concerns. What else? Last card is a high priestess. So intuitively you're being guided to look past everything from the past and you being made to realize it is time to step up your game and move ahead in your life and focus on something which uh, brings you stability in your future. Okay, so you being intuitively guided, there is a voice within you who's speaking to you saying, it's literally time. It's literally time to cut off the past. Let go of the past. Don't even think about it. Block him, uh, block him or her on Insta. Yeah? Just, you know, delete the contact from your contact list. Block him on uh, WhatsApp, whatever. Okay, it's, it's almost like, you know, I'm done. I'm done looking back. That kind of an energy. Because your first card is a six of swords. It's, it's that realization which has come through. It's time to move on with my life because this is a dead end. It's not going anywhere. Okay? I didn't even see this card, but this is about having that clarity. Having that breakthrough clarity regards to this whole situation and what needs to be done. How should I go about my life now? How should I transform my life? What should I work on right now? It's plain and simple. Hmm? I don't think so. I have to clarify anything else. Let's see what this judgment is about. He just swords. So it's almost like someone is literally standing up voicing their opinion, uh, voicing their thoughts regards to the situation. Even uh, with the fire swords, it's almost like, you know, confront, confrontational mode. This is how it is. It's almost like passing a verdict by yourself, you know, like giving, you know, this is it. The ultimatum. This is how it is. This is how it's going to be. So I'm done. Hmm? Yeah, with the seven of swords, it's it's like uh, not playing around the bushes anymore. It's out there in the open. Again, speaking about putting things out. Um, you know, it's 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 not hidden anymore. Okay, along with the page of swords, it's someone is speaking out. Someone is making it very clear, crystal clear. Okay, regards to the verdict. It doesn't have to be a judiciary system which is passing the verdict. It, is, it might be just you who is just speaking out. Oh, well, we are done. I'm not going to waste my time on you anymore. That kind of a verdict. That kind of a judgment. Hmm? Making it just you know, as clear as a, as a day. Give me more. Judgment. Because you have come to that realization. There is no playing around anymore. There is no juggling anymore with the situation. It's not, it's just not worth it. Because you understand the person whom you're dealing with is not the one. What else is? La la, justice and reverse. So I was speaking about, um, you know, you might not go to the judiciary system, blah, blah, blah. Um, some of you might be actually, you know, now this is, 
uh, things have come to such clarity because of the injustice which uh, was done. Okay, you might have been wronged. The other person might have wronged you and you know moved on with their life. You coming through as a person who is very rebellious now. You know, it's it's almost like a uh, bitch mode. You don't care a shit like how people are going to feel if you say things. It's just going to come come out. You're going to spit it out. You're just going to spit it out. Because you have been wronged. Okay? That's why you're taking this approach. You're not mincing words. At least not today. Not anymore. Yeah. You're finally ready to let go of the burden which was weighing you down for quite some time. You don't want to carry this burden anymore. It's, it's just not worth it. You have been struggling. It has been a challenge. But was it any good? So that realization, that you are at that phase when you where you realize what for? Give me one more card on this judgment. On the justice and Yes. Yeah. Uh, three of cups in reverse. Somebody was very foolish. Okay. Uh, the reason why. Um, things have come to this full circle might be because of a third party involvement. Um, somebody uh, literally was a fool. Okay, somebody was foolish in the way they acted. That is why I said you have been wronged. Because hmm? this is coming into the picture. Multiple people are coming into the picture. And that's why you, you're done. Yeah, you don't want to be the third wheel anymore. Yeah. You're trying to bring, uh, by you know, being done with this, you're trying to bring a balance in your life. Because, yeah, just made up your mind already. I don't want to carry this crap in my life anymore. It is toxic. I don't want to deal with this person because he or she has done this to me and I'm not willing to get over it anymore. Okay? Anything else? Why do you say his side of the story? His or her side of the story with this Knight of Cups? Can you see the cups? Knight of Cups in reverse, what's that about? Sun card in reverse. Okay? So there is darkness. Okay? And if you see the couple energy uh, below the sun, it's in reverse though. So there is darkness. Uh, looking at the Ace of Pentacles. With regards to this whole situation, from their end. Okay, for them it's not working out and it feels like something better might have come through. I had to wait for a moment to even uh, say it out loud. For them they felt uh, whatever they were holding on to, it is not good enough and there is something better out there. They're not willing to work um, with you anymore. Uh, they might have been very stressed out about how things are, okay? But there is so much things in the darkness. Even uh, when I look at the sun card in reverse and 
um, the moon card upright okay both these cards say the same thing in these positions things were hidden things were under the wrap okay it's it's behind the veil it was not out there in the open secrets all that okay uh, and this person had loads of secrets they were hiding stuff from their partner and they were very much stressed about it's almost like they were doing a double life you know without energy as well the multiple uh, people they had another life a night life which they kept under the wraps you know pretty pretty much concealed they might have been losing their sleep over this you know juggling with whatever was going on with their life like they have a night of thoughts but they were passionate to go about it they did juggle it quite well they did manage to put up this act for quite some time give me one more card this one actually yes literally i was speaking about the fool earlier somebody was being foolish uh got along with the three of cups and reverse same it's just a confirmation okay this is the reason why um you know you might be with this person the significant other but then behind the back uh you're being full happy they were up to something in the dark with other people okay that is the reason why things got screwed up I also want to say this person might not be apologizing for the behavior. That's it. Hmm? They're not willing to accept. Uh, they screwed it up. Okay. Y you cannot expect any kind of an apology to come through from this person. If you're waiting for that, you're going to wait for a very long time. Yes, nine of wands. This person is not even looking back. For them, it's like, oh, it's done, then it's done. Okay. Adios. That kind of a, you know. Yeah, they might have just moved on with their life. No, just okay. from one person okay we are done okay i'm going to move to the other person that kind of a person not a good energy i think i'm done it's it's way past the cap i'm just only keeping it for 15 to 20 minutes and that's it so that's it for now this is marishi no much out to look at until next week bye bye